Hey everyone, History Mystery Man here, coming to you today from Minster, Ohio, on my way to Eldor Speedway. Wish I had a little better day for you. It's raining, but that's okay. It's supposed to clear up for racing tonight. So really looking forward to getting back to Eldor. I haven't been there to a race for more than 20 years, but this is why I love small town America. This Minster, Ohio, population maybe 2,800, all the way down the main street. Look at the signs up there. Okay, every one of them honoring a U.S. veteran. And this lines the entire main drag. It goes on forever. Okay, and it's not just the main drag. You can go down the side streets and the salutes to the veterans, the memorials are everywhere. It's, it's fantastic. This is why I love small town America. Who else does this? Small town America just gets it. There's no crime here in Minster. You can leave your doors open. Nobody's worried about who's killing who because nobody's killing anyone. It's beautiful. This town is absolutely spectacular. Side street, the signs for the veterans all the way down. Yep. I mean, there must be hundreds of them lining the streets of Minster, Ohio. Good for you, Minster. And look at all these beautiful downtown buildings. Look at that little brick causeway here really super well preserved somebody you can tell the residents of minster ohio care about their town and they're not the kind of folks who are going to put up with any sort of disruptions uh beautiful homes all the way down through look at this what's that wow that is cool it looks like independence hall wow oh look at this church oh that's a nice house sweet look at that stone beauty Woo. <laughs> I know, I'm getting lost in Minster. Look at that church, the big tall steeples. How beautiful. My goodness. Old school, or at least it used to be a school. Now it's a business community center. See, they didn't knock it over though. They preserved it and made it something else. This is what small town America is so good at doing. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it's so so hard for me to just pass through these towns without taking a look. I, look at that. My God, that's beautiful. So well preserved. What is it? I'm dying to know. Wow. Look at these, look at these homes. Everybody takes good care of their homes here. Everybody. The properties are immaculate. My God. Minster could be a model for the world. It, it, it look at this little community park here. Very cool. Little pagoda or whatever that is. Whatever they call them. Look at, look at, ooh, Oktoberfest it says up on that cool old building. I love that building. All right, we're just going to come back to the main drag. I'm not going to keep you long here today. I just want you to give a glimpse of why I love small town America. I mean... Who wouldn't want to live here? I mean, just look at it. So clean. Village of Minster Administration Building. Sweet, sweet. Oh, nice, nice, nice. The Heritage Shop. Newer bank, that's okay. Oh, look at this. Is that cool or what? They left the old Farns Complete Food Service Pepsi Cola worn out sign on the side of these iconic historic buildings. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, and some grain elevators. This is farm country. Corn crops all around. Ah, uh, yeah. Anyway, I just wanted you to see this place and to give you an idea of why I love small town America. I mean, who wouldn't love this? Look at that old building. Ooh, sweetness. Coming over the railroad tracks. Okay. I, I, every time I want to shut this thing off, I see something else super duper cool like that. Or this. This old farm. That old outbuilding back there. These farms that attach these small towns across Ohio are just spectacular. Thanks for joining me for Don Radeball. I am the History Mystery Man, and I'll look forward to bringing you more coverage from the world-famous Eldora Speedway. That's next. Thanks for tagging along. So getting out of town here at Minster, I just had to show you this one real quick. 
Look at that. Look at this old farmhouse. Is that beautiful or what? Look at the, oh my God, that's 1800 something, but my God, so well preserved. Yeah, I, I just, I wanna go inside that house so, so bad it's driving me nuts. I'm about ready to go pound on the door, but I'm not, I don't have that kind of courage, but I love that, the simplicity of that old 1870 something farmhouse. It's just beautiful. I love it. Small town America, baby and its connecting tributaries. It's an old mariner's term.